the Dubai vlog first time in Dubai we have just woken up it's actually the afternoon so Dubai is three hours behind and it's like 10 a.m. in the UK but we were so shattered and I kind of knew this was gonna happen but we're tired however I wanted to start the vlog here uh -huh, it's a lot more comfortable yeah we're so tired we were so tired even waking up at 1 p.m. was a struggle but anyways we're dressed and ready now to head to the pool I am in this knitted PLT dress that I bought absolutely ages ago, I think even pre-being pregnant. And it's been in my wardrobe with the tags on and I've never worn it. Um, so we're going to head down to the pool and we're in that and I'm just wearing a kind of bandeau, one size stretchy bikini. Um, the weather looks absolutely insane. It looks so nice. Craig and Sienna are in the background. Um, we literally have like the most chilled, well, couple hours since waking up. Um, so the plan is to head down to the pool. We really want to go to the Cheesecake Factory later. Um, we're staying at the W Dubai. We're staying at the W on the palms. So the view, let me show you. From our balcony. So firstly, the balcony size is just like mammoth. Like that's how deep our balcony goes this summer lounger where i fed sienna this morning or afternoon i should say and then this the views from our room the atlantis and the new atlantis hotel where beyonce stayed this is going to be a very very windy part of the video so apologies this side we just have water so yeah we're staying and we are in the wonderful room so i think it's just like standard room for the W. Um, Sienna is being a proper moany, wingy baby at the minute so we are gonna head out the room. I think she's just a bit bored of being here so we're gonna make a move. Hey big boy, you ready to go? I have to show you her, her swimwear actually, it's so cute. Hi, your first time in swimwear. Oh, you look so cute, Munchkin girl. Where's your hat? Look at that hat. It's SPF 50. <laughs> Anyways, me get us ready to get out of here. I will probably give you guys a room tour at some point, but the room's a bit of a state at the minute. Um, oh, look. Look at her little hat. It's just so adorable. So, the reason we're in Dubai is actually because it's Craig's birthday. It's he was this, been a while, it's been a while. He was the same one that was like, why are you vlogging? I was like, Jesus Christ, we only <laughs> arrived and it was night time. So, I was like, I had all, I, my plans were to vlog today. Um, so, yeah. yeah. Craig's birthday trip to Dubai. Let's go. just found the perfect little spot to do my makeup in natural daylight 
and I've got my little compact mirror case which is so so handy for like makeup that when you do your makeup and you're not in your usual spot and it comes with a really cute brush holder as well which I'm actually loving my lashes are officially a mess by the way that's Atlantis Hotel in the back I thought this is such a nice like look how glowy it looks um, this is such a nice backdrop to do my makeup Sienna's having a nap I quickly flew into the shower so we had a nice little day by the pool checked out our pool and at the hotel and obviously now traveling with a baby means we're going to be in the family section um but in all honesty it was absolutely fine very clean food was incredible so i'm going to do my makeup now and we're going to head to point um i don't know if i mentioned but this is my first time to dubai so i don't actually know the places to be but i know this is somewhere i wanted to go check out the fountain show so that is what i'm getting ready to do at the minute and i'm just trying to do my skincare but my brain's all over the place i recently realized i'm allergic to vitamin c or i've overused vitamin c products and now i'm severely allergic like i did a vitamin c mask the other day before i realized it was vitamin c serums and stuff that was messing my face up and my eyelids got like so swollen my eyelids were so swollen i looked like i was stung by like ten thousand bees it was actually mental how crazy my face looked um but i've been using this this is what i picked up when i went to new york it's the glow recipe water glow niacinamide dew drops and this has now become my absolute favorite serum especially if you're going no makeup because it, there's a subtle glow to it there's like like it's not sparkles but it's i think i did a swatch in one of my previous vlogs so i won't do it again um but it's so good and perfect for like no makeup looks but also adds a bit of glow under your foundation if which is pretty much what i'm doing now i'm gonna oh I'll probably wear a bit of foundation tonight. Also, I have no idea what the sound sounds like at the minute. It might be a bit windy. If it is, then well, this probably didn't make the cut. So fingers crossed. So I've not even been in Dubai 24 hours, and I already know here's definitely somewhere I'd like to come back. I feel like there's so many places to go. Everywhere seems to be a vibe. It kind of reminds me of Las Vegas. Like when we arrived, and it was like city lights and bright lights, and everything just looked like no shortcuts were taken like everything just looks unreal um yeah i was like this is my kind of vibe i i really like it and the weather has been absolutely amazing today so we're really really happy about that. so i think after this trip i'm going to take my lashes off completely because i just feel like i need a bit of a break now and it's just so hard to maintain like they fall out so quickly and they kind of just drive me insane because I've got this one lash here that's hanging on for dear life and I just hate the positioning of it because the lashes next to it have fallen out it just looks like really bizarre there by themselves um so yeah that's a bit annoying my eyebrow stuff I've left inside that's annoying as well so here is a quick mole update Craig in the background a nice movie, Craig. Here's a quick mole update. So I just realized I never updated you guys on my mole removal, like skin tags and moles. And uh, oh my goodness, it came out so well, so well. Like I'm so, so pleased with the outcome. All of the skin tags and moles I had around there have gone. My face just feels so much smoother. I am definitely going to go back next time I go to Trinidad. I'm going to have to go back and get her to do another course because I still have a few there um, that she didn't do. Um, and I've got some really, really tiny ones that she said she didn't do as well. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, I realised I'm going to take like 10 times longer to do my makeup if I sit and talk. So plan is I do makeup we're gonna to go to the point we're gonna watch the fountain show we're gonna have a little walk around that area and then we're gonna to head to the cheesecake factory because I've been thinking about a thousand calorie cheesecake since the last time I've been to the cheesecake factory which is 
a couple of years ago now so I'm looking forward to that we're not really that hungry right now so we're gonna go kill some time at the point check out the fountain show see what else is in that area and then yeah cheesecake factory it's fine. So, so guys this is a finished look just a simple sort of glowy everyday sort of makeup look I'm now gonna go do my hair um, I kind of just shoved it all in a claw clip. Do you know what's really good? It's not like horrible, sticky, hot weather. It's like so nice. The wind is cool. It is just perfect to just sit and do your makeup. So yeah, definitely found my new makeup spot. Sadly, there's no outlets out here though to do my hair. So I'm gonna go in and do my hair and I'm gonna give it a little quick, quick sort of wavy, might have my hair down, might not, haven't really decided yet. Um, but yeah, and I'm going to wear this top, which is the Skims bodysuit. And my plan is to wear some white trousers, which I haven't put on yet. So yeah, let's um, get started. So all the way here, and we think it might be delayed. We think they're not going to do it because of the weather. Although the weather seems fine, I think it's just a bit windy. Yeah. Not sure, but anyways, Atlantis behind us. It's stunning, by the way. Absolutely stunning. So we have found a bar right opposite where the light show is. I don't know whether the light show is actually happening or not, so let's see what it is. Vibes get a little cute shit, they all gone. I'm from Atlanta with your nigga, Ryan shit. I know they hating on me, but I don't read comments. Whenever I tell her to come, she comes. Whenever it's smoke, we ain't burning. Absolutely shattered. It's just gone after midnight and we've just left the Cheesecake Factory, just waiting for an Uber now. And um, we've just been using Uber to get around. Seems to be pretty easy and there's loads of Ubers, so really, really frequent. Um, but yeah, gonna head home and shattered. shower and go to sleep because we're absolutely tired. But Sienna is it's like, Loving it. She caught a second wind earlier. She can't stop looking around um, and it's way past her bedtime but there's so many babies out like until you have a baby that like, you don't realize how many babies there are out because um, so I was thinking it's well past her bedtime but clearly there's no bedtime hours in Dubai. So glad we got to go to the Cheesecake Factory though. I've been thinking about it since my last trip to the US and What's annoying is they actually did not have any of the flavors that I wanted, yes, but it, cinnamon. yeah. <laughs> Ran out of storage, but as I was saying, they didn't have any of the Oreo, they didn't have any Cinnabon, they didn't have the salted caramel, so we had to go rogue. Craig got red velvet and I got pineapple upside down, which was actually really nice and I had to take half of it back to the hotel because it was so sweet but it was so delicious. Um, so yeah, we're checking out for today and we will see you guys tomorrow. Good afternoon guys. So, we woke up very late again today and our plans, so basically we're going on a yacht today and our plans was to come down to the marina a couple hours before we have to go have a bite to eat and just like not rush and basically we ended up sleeping till about 20 to 1 and had to rush to get here but we're here now and um, we're at the marina and just waiting to find out what yacht we're getting on um, which is exciting this is Sienna's first yacht trip or boat trip in general um, 
but I am excited. I'm absolutely, we're hiding from the sun at the minute, we're in the shade. Um, Sienna's just having her sun cream put on her, and yeah, we're just waiting to hear from our captain to find out where we go to meet them. It is really, really hot, not gonna lie. So I hope there's some shady parts of this yacht because Sienna's too young to be in direct sunlight for too long. So we've made it onto our boat, and it is, quite impressive not gonna lie even Craig was like is that our boat yeah I was expecting it to be some I think this is this was Craig's birthday gift by the way so I don't know why he was expecting it to be like a little tugboat like put some respect on my name please yeah. I'll show you guys a little tour because it's quite cute so we've got a kitchen area so that's the entrance and then we've got this kitchen area got some cold drinks there um, and then we have this little sort of loungy area another seating area a ladder that goes up to the deck um, I don't think they use this I don't know the captain's bags and stuff's on there um, and then down here we've got oh my god it's got so many bedrooms so there's a bunk beds in here and then down these stairs there is another room so we've got bed and looks like a little storage area um how cute but yeah we are on the move now i don't know if you can see through that window we're on the move um so i guess that's like the main room and then we've got bunk beds in there as i mentioned and then we've got another room through here. I feel like I'm in a film. So there's another big room. Lots of mirrors and there's a TV on the wall. Toilet, well this is a shower. Sorry, it's really dark. And, and some, I guess, storage. I don't know, I'm not gonna open. I'm not gonna open anything, but then back up the stairs. Back up. Kiddies. It's nice and uh, it's nice and air conned in here as well. We're just gonna chill and enjoy our little yacht trip today. The sun is like right on us, but it doesn't feel like scorching. It's so nice. Sienna is having a nap in one of the beds, and yeah, where all we need is like all we need is a glass of prosecco with this moment, or champagne at this moment. We're just being one. Really for me, I thought you were my wife. 